Yeah, Tony, just uh, watching the soccer action and uh, getting ready for a night to just basketball and hoop. Baseball missed a golden opportunity, but, you know, we got to have the World Series got to be, you know, set in stone. Got to Can't just bump up the series because one ends early. World Series, you got to have a set schedule. So a little bit unfortunate. Uh, a lot of people do things on Friday nights, and uh, that's when the World Series will start. But that's okay. People will be watching. Yeah, they'll be watching. I think they have to cram the games in. But again, uh, it's a situation where it's usually the foreign media. You get people from across the country. Uh, I know that firsthand at Dodger Stadium when the blue section, a lot of it is taken up by the foreign media. And that's really what it is. They got to get the hotel rooms and uh, you get the people from across the country, across the world, actually covering this event. So uh, that's the reason for that. But anyway, go back to the ice tonight here at 735 East time. I think we might have some... Um, Rest advantage in this one. Islanders are hosting the Rangers here. Islanders lane 130, the total six. Well, the Rangers have a back-to-back. -back. That's why, Tony, and the Islanders, maybe that uh, odd, those odds indicate, because I'm not sure you'd get the Rangers uh, very frequently at this kind of price uh, at this point of the season or all season. Uh, the Rangers looked pretty good last night uh, against Colorado, but they were at home and uh, the game ended up going to a shootout before Colorado got the win. So for a Rangers team that had been struggling a little bit, this is a third game in four nights, as you might have been alluding to, Tony. And the Rangers have scored just five goals in their last uh, three games, in the last three games. So uh, maybe it will be uh, Yaroslav Halak in there for Igor Shosturkin. Now, we don't have any confirmation of that yet, but I just feel like the line kind of indicates that uh, Igor will not be in net tonight and that Halak, the former Islander, uh, Sororkin's buddy, if you will, those guys are friends, uh, uh, he'll be in goal possibly tonight so uh Sorokin so far hasn't really been able to get on track and neither have the Islanders necessarily both teams have lost three straight games Sorokin is one and three out of the Islanders six games so far and the Islanders are just two and four but Islanders playing pretty decent defense or allowing just three goals a game it's the offense that hasn't really been able to get on track for New York. They have been uh, shuffling the uh, lines a little bit here over the last game or two, and they'll, again, probably do so tonight. Sorokin, 2.84 on the goals against with a 90 point, uh, point nine eight, point nine oh eight save percentage, much better than uh, Halak's 0-2 record so far with a 4.03 goals against and 0.852 save percentage. So, uh, that would give Halak two of the last three starts. Maybe that's why they're waiting. Maybe we'll see what happens. Maybe the skate hasn't occurred yet. And Sorokin, uh, I mean, uh, 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 Igor Shosturkin can be in there for the second night in a row despite the overtime game last night because uh, right now when you've lost three straight, both teams are kind of you know, struggling for a, a victory, if you will. So, uh, of course, before the game against uh, Colorado, they lost – to San Jose. They also lost uh, to Columbus as part of that losing streak. But the Islanders have been done well in this series. They've won six of the last eight meetings and 10 of the last 12 meetings have gone under. That may indeed uh, end up happening here again if the Islanders can't get their scoring going and uh, the Rangers may be forced to play a more defensive oriented game without the uh, standard of Igor Shesterkin in goal that to protect Halak a little bit more if Halak, uh, you know, has seen better days or for whatever reason his uh, numbers are not uh, up to par so far right now. Now the road team did win all four games last year in this very frequent series. So uh, also mentioned the one time so far Rangers were on a back-to-back -back this year, Tony. They uh, beat the Minnesota Wild 7-3 to in a very uh, confident performance. You might remember that one. And then they came back the next night and lost to the Winnipeg Jets, 4-1. to one. So I'm going to take the Islanders tonight with Sorokin. Uh, if, if Igor's in there, I'll have to uh, eat that. But uh, right now, to me, at a buck 30 or a buck 35, uh, I think uh, it's going to be Sorokin and Halak. And I think the line is uh, indicating that here. So I'm going to take the Islanders tonight as a favorite in this one. 
All right, we've got uh, Ramon here uh, coming in here on the Islanders here, minus 135 here against uh, the Rangers. And it's a pretty significant rest advantage here with the Rangers on a back-to-back. -back. And noting here, Ramon, that it is two days of rest here for the Islanders. And in this spot where they've had two days of rest, they've won four straight. Yeah, and uh, again, that series history has been with the Islanders, uh, which might be might come as a surprise to some. Now, uh, in the three losses that the Islanders have occurred, I mentioned uh, uh, the three consecutive losses coming in the game. They've been outscored 12 to 6. So that is of some concern uh, for me, but I think that's why both teams might be in defensive mode tonight, and maybe that will help the Islanders in this situation. Halak has not been uh, uh, very sharp when playing his old team. He's 0-2-2 uh, uh, in the last four matchups against them. So uh, I'm going to look for the Islanders to uh, take this one as a favorite. Kind of interesting that the road team has won the last uh, four matchups. And uh, again, I mean, it's a you know, one of the most frequent series you can have, really, the Islanders and the Rangers. Whether it's a rivalry anymore or not, I'm not sure. But maybe Islanders, uh, you know, were having a pretty good streak for a couple of years before missing the playoffs last season. Of course, Rangers are expected to do a little more right now than uh, than what they're doing. So uh, we'll see if they can turn it around. But I'm going to take the uh, Islanders tonight. Like I said, uh, their new coach shuffling the lineups a little bit, trying to find the right formula for uh, success offensively. Uh, that's what they're going to need right now. A little bit more scoring from the Islanders to help me get this one. All right, Islanders minus 135 here against the Rangers. This one to have a start time here of 7.30 Eastern time. All right, Ramon, let's take a look over at TonySpicks.com for today's action where you've been on absolute fire. 1,824 units of profit over the last 30 days. That is all documented over at TonySpicks.com. So when you go to Ramon's handicapper page, you can verify all that information. It is there for you to check out. All right, Ramon, uh, we've got a big game, in the, a big card here from the NBA. Ten games up there, three, three on the ice. What do you have going on over at Tony's Picks? Strictly on the hardwood right now, Tony, with five plays. I've got a five-pack up at TonySpicks.com for $30. Coming off an 0-2 night, I said, hey, I'm going to have to, uh, you know, give a little bit of a, a deal to the uh, to my subscribers, to my players, if you will. Uh, just played two games last night, one in each, uh, one NHL, one NBA, took a loss in both. So let's come back with a five-pack tonight in the NBA where I put up really good numbers uh, so far uh, this season. You see him right there, pretty solid start to the season to continue uh, my good run over here at Tony'sPicks.com. Uh, nearly 3,000 units since the inception of the site uh, 43 games over 500, and these are, you know, pretty much just uh, straight uh, totals and sides. So that's a pretty good uh, track record, if I may so say so uh, myself. And I'm going to hang my hat on that record tonight after last night's 0-2 and, and say we get it done with this five-pack tonight over at Tony'sPicks.com. Use that promo code Tony T at checkout. Save even more. Make it a real good deal tonight. If you haven't joined me for any of my picks, maybe tonight's the night. We put you on the winning track, and you can, uh, you know, jump on board with me again the following night. Let's start a winning streak heading into the weekend. That's right, guys. You got a board here from Scott over at Tony's Picks. We put the numbers up there, and they've been very impressive for Ramon over uh, the last uh, uh, 30 days. Uh, uh, 1,824 units of profit, all documented over at TonySpeaks.com. And, of course, uh, today, right now, Ramon has his five-pack up there for you right now from the NBA. So get on board with that. That is profit guarantee on the uh, one-day passes. means they must turn up profit or the amount you purchase is credited back in your account for site credits. That's profit guarantee. But, again, the long-term passes are not because they're sold already at discount prices. You may consider the one-month all-sports pass here for Ramon. The way he's running right now in all sports, again, we've showed you the records here. Look at this. This is what he's winning it. You know, that's, that's pretty impressive there, right, uh, for, for 2022. Uh, you can take a look at that. So uh, why don't you get on board with the longer-term pass here. One-month pass here uh, from Ramon. Get you all of Ramon's premium plays here uh, for 30 days. And, of course, Ramon will be in action here, of course, in the NFL. Also uh, with college football here uh, for a, a one-month action there as well as uh, his baseball, the entire World Series, NHL, and, of course, college 
basketball, which begins a week from Monday. That's right. We have a monster card there. It's over 100 games. <laughs> I was already looking at some of the schedules that I'm looking at. it. Uh, but uh, again, I'll board there with Moan. Of course, I will say this. It is a World Cup year. We're probably about three weeks away, uh, less than that now, from the start of the World Cup. I'm pretty sure he's going to be in action in the World Cup. It's the biggest biggest tournament in the world. I wouldn't be surprised. He's going to be in action there. That's also would also be part of that one month all sports pass. Get you about a week of coverage there in the World Cup. So uh, get on board there. Um, that was Ramon Scott here with that one month all sports pass. Get all of his premium plays for that period of time. You select when you go to his handicapper page and make that purchase. We're going to save you some money right now. We use that promo code uh, Tony T at checkout. You can take 20% off there. You can access Ramon's page by clicking the link in the description, then click on the all cappers tab and get signed up. And when you do click that link, this is where you'll land right here on this page. And just so you got to scroll down a little bit here when you feel his profile page, find out a little bit about Ramon. See the numbers he's putting up. They've been fantastic here across all sports. And you come down and see what's individually for sale. The, the orange is the one-day passes. And then the, the yellow here is the long-term passes. It's several long-term passes up there. We just notif we just brought attention to the one-month pass. I mean, that promo code will save you $66. But you can get, he's got a one-year pass, also sports passes up there. So get on board there. Pick ticker, if you want to buy, you want to just go a la carte. Uh, you can do that as well and buy these plays individually. Again, uh, of course, as you do you add it up, you know, you probably your best value obviously will be on the long term pass. But of course, some people just want to buy the individual a la carte purchase. You can do that. And again, if any pick shows up in green here, that's a late steam. And each capper can do that. Each to own. We got cappers that are on it. Some that, you know, are, are, are just new. It's new. It's a new feature. So we'll see how it works here for some of them. Uh, the cappers have the ability to enter a pick within 10 minutes and two hours of game time. And for Ramon's long-term and package uh, customers, and for all of long-term package customers, for your, your individual capper who enters a play into the system that starts between 10 minutes and two hours, you'll you'll receive an email notification with the pick in the email, with the pick in the email. So you'll get that pick there in the email. Uh, with that, you will have a five-minute. Uh, uh, you'll be five minutes ahead of everyone else with it because uh, it doesn't hit our pick ticker until five minutes. You'll, you'll have a five minute exclusive window for that play before it gets uh, put on the site for individual sale there also with the uh, long term pass uh, customers. But again, if you're looking for an individual play on the late team, it'll be in green here. Uh, uh, of course, we'll, closer to game time, you may look it up. But again, some cappers will, some cappers will, will be selective. So just it's just, a, just something to note of if you check your inboxes there for the long-term customers. Again, uh, get on board with Ramon. He's doing fantastic work. And use that promo code to save 20% off. All right, Ramon, we've also put together a, a Twitter account for you over at Tony Speaks Ramon with more picks. And of course, that great show you and Mindy uh, with the morning steam Saturday through Thursday. Yeah, and my pick tonight uh, is in the NHL over at Tony's Picks Ramon. So head on over to uh, Twitter and log on to your account and make sure you follow Tony's Picks Ramon where I put a pick up there usually five or six days a week if I can. And uh, tonight got a pick over there in the NHL on a total. So uh, I'm laid low on the ice tonight after last night's loss. So uh, got my play over there uh, at Tony's Picks Ramon. Uh, in one of the games on a total and Mindy and I will be back at it tomorrow with more morning steam and team steam uh, look to uh, had our uh, rough night after a winning streak going so you look at the numbers of team steam uh, our consensus plays over there doing pretty solid work there too talking about the success that I have here uh, on my uh, on my account if you will call it what you will but uh, Selling my picks here at Tony'sPicks.com. Well, Mindy and I have our show where we present our picks, and when we have a consensus pick, we announce it to the world absolutely free on our show every morning, uh, Saturday through Thursday, anyway, six days a week. And we also repackage those for those that don't have time to watch the show or don't want to do the legwork of uh, finding the particular podcast of that particular game or that particular video on YouTube. We just package them up real convenient over there for you and uh, resell them over there at Tony'sPicks.com. So if you miss the show, you can still support us a little bit. Make sure we stay on the air with Tony and you get the picks as well uh, from the show. So uh, that's just the way we've kind of formulated things. It's worked out pretty good and we're having a lot of fun with it. So uh, make sure you check out the morning steam. You don't have to, you don't have to buy those picks if you don't want to, but you got to watch us. Uh, over at uh, the Tony'sPicks.com YouTube channel and all the major platforms. 
That's right, guys. Uh, check out the morning steam uh, Saturday through Thursday, 9 a.m. Eastern time on YouTube. Get those consensus plays for free when you watch the show. You got to pay if you don't watch the show. <laughs> you got to go over there to the website. Some do, and that's okay. And, of course, you can also get those consensus plays uh, via podcast. And we already had people chime in the right work watching the show. That's right. I want to make note about our podcast, Tony's Picks, on all the major platforms. Hey, with this Bluetooth technology, you can get your phone, Bluetooth it in your car for your drive home. Tune into the morning steam uh, today. The full show is up there in podcast form, so you can watch one hour plus breakdown of the entire card for today, NBA, as well as uh, NHL. And, of course, they've de delved into some of the college football cards. There's 47 games this week, uh, FBS versus FBS, and you can't do them in one day, so they spread it out over the week. So tune into the podcast on your way home from work today. Tony's Picks Podcast, Morning Steam. Get the full breakdown for today's card. Uh, Saturday through Thursday. Today, today's show is up there right now. So check it out on the podcast. All right, Ramon, it's always uh, great having your show. Continue uh, that great work, and we'll talk with you again tomorrow. See you then, Tony. Thank you. You got it, Ramon Scott here.